Start falling deeper. Cold nights that no shit on. Kids I need. Okay, so in today's video, we are in the streets of Saigon, Vietnam, and we're going to a $12 Taiwanese hot pot restaurant. So it's 300,000 Vietnam dong, $12 USD, and it's all you can eat, all you can drink, and supposedly there's no time limit. Zero time limit. What kind of fish is that? What kind of fish? Do you know? I don't know it either. To be honest, I had no idea either. And really, for a $12 buffet, I didn't ask any questions. That there is tofu skin that was put in there. I'm not entirely sure what it is, but it kind of has a, a, a bite to it, kind of like a meaty consistency. There she's throwing in a little bit of beef, which was very good. So here it goes. This is the journey begins. The first bowl. I, got, I was thinking about grabbing the shrimp. No, I thought maybe it wasn't cooked yet. Went and got some bok choy there, some of the fish, obviously the steam hitting, <laughs> hitting the camera lens. Look at that broth. Ooh, it was good. And you know, it's nice too because it had some spice to it. But then also, as you're continually throwing things into the broth, you know, it just gives it more flavor. You know, you got the seafood, the veggies, the mushroom. That is the tofu skin, which I love that. Crazy sauce here. Yeah. And I'm not too sure what's in it. Actually, on that note, let me show you what's in it. So first we're throwing in a little bit of chili sauce. I was told that I was that they were not sure about what everything that was in it, but it's definitely a lot of chili. There's a little bit more chili sauce. Also not too sure. Definitely have some peppers in there, some real chilies. Uh, a little bit of green onion. A little bit of sesame seed. And I will give it up to her. She did a good job building this. Some peanuts, because why not? Finish it with a little bit of cilantro, which is one of my favorite herbs. A little fun fact. Squeeze a little bit of Vietnamese lime juice, or the equivalent of. Uh, a little bit of, that was soy sauce. This is a touch of sesame oil. And there you go, the finished product. Mix it all up, and man, that's, that, that is seriously one of the best sauces, especially with the meat. It's got some like cilantro, some peanuts, some sesame seeds. It's really good. Oh yeah, that's very good. It's salty, it's spicy too. It's got a lot of flavors going on there. So here we go, grabbing some of the fish cake. It's like a processed, meaty, ground-up fish cake. Some tofu, throwing it in the hot pot. And I'm just letting the camera know that I can't believe this. It's so cool being able to pull it off the line. I've never been to a place like that before. I never knew hot pot places could be like that. And here we have the nice waitress here dropping off some fresh greens. And here we go. I thought it was liver, but it was confirmed that it was heart. And I believe it was chicken heart. Okay, here we go. Here's round two. So scooping up, it looks like the heart there that I got. Which, if you've never had heart, it's not bad. There's a little bit of tofu and some mushroom. I believe that's some more of that tofu skin there. Next, we got a little bit of the beef. Here we go, shrimp number one. This guy's the shrimp head number one. Gonna get all the mustard and brains out of there. There we go, pro sucker there. Look at that. Strong cheeks, firm grip, thumbs up. Now here we go with round two of the shrimp. By the way, this was 60,000 Vietnam Dong for two people to eat these shrimp, which is 30,000 per person, unlimited, which is just over a dollar, which is insane. Here we have a little bit of squid, I believe, and that green sauce, oh man, that is one of my favorite sauces in Vietnam. It's spicy, salty, and it kind of has a salsa verde taste. And here, this was a mystery. I believe it was like a fish, beef, meatball stuffed with quail egg. Not too sure, but dipped it in that amazing sauce. And pretty much anything will please me when I dip it in that. And man, that was good. I ate a few of those, and I enjoyed it. Next, we got the mystery. This was I was told this was fish stomach. Some okra there. And we got a little bit of uh, fish cake. It's kind of like a mixture. Here we have some noodles. I had to do that. I couldn't resist the colors. 
So I just have to say this, because the music is so loud in there, I can't say anything. This place is crazy. I've never been to a hot pot spot quite like this. And honestly, it's super cool. And, and now I know why it's so popular here in Asia. So here's another look back at that sauce bar here. You got the cilantro, the chilies, all those different sauces, some herbs, sesame seeds. Here they have a few variations of teas, a couple more teas, the fountain drink, Coca-Cola for the win. Their marketing is insane. And some very nice ice cream. Had a nice little ice cream bar. Gentlemen getting some Vietnamese dessert. And ladies and gentlemen, we're back to the bowl. They're the noodles that came back out of the hot pot, which I was pretty excited to eat. This would be my third bowl unofficially, but it might have been the fourth. Honestly, I can't remember. I ate to win. Here we have some bok choy coming in that topped it off because I had to put some veggies. And like any good foreigner that's taking advantage of the buffet, before I eat that bowl, I got to throw the pork in the pot and grab a mushroom. Throw it back in there. I love mushrooms in my soup. It's one of my favorite things. And honestly, the best soups I've had in Vietnam have been vegetarian based. Throw a little bit of uh, the greenery and I had to try some of the fish stomach. Um, I thought it was intestine, but I guess it was stomach, which I think is about the same thing. Maybe it's a little bit cleaner. And one piece of okra for the fans. And there it is. Had to dip my tongs in there to sanitize them. And we're going on shrimp number two thing was burning my hands because it was hot but I didn't let it down for more than a second I picked it up continued on there it is look it's a pretty big head there and honestly I thought there'd be a lot more brain here's a peek for the camera can not even really see sorry about that and here we go firm grip get the brains out of there yep and of course finish it with a thumbs up here's a look at the shrimp before they enter their final destination or before their final destination. So that thing is a beast. Look at that behemoth. Their arms are crazy long. I still can't get over the fact it was 30k per person. So there we go guys getting dipped in there. Now that's also after the $12 base fee. Which is still insanely cheap right? Some clams going by on the conveyor belt. Here we have some s jellyfish I was told. I thought it was squid. But I guess it's jellyfish. To be honest, I didn't like that either. It wasn't very good. I, the flavor was kind of weird. And I pulled this guy out, and this looked like the hot pot monster. Freaking from the depths. It's like the 1950s scary movie main character right there. Coming onto my plate. And here we go, shrimp number three. This was the guy that did me in, to be honest. Um... It was it was interesting. So there we go. We do the twist. It was hot. Picked it up. Looked down the barrel. Went after it. And I'm not going to lie. I shot a blank on this one. For whatever reason, there wasn't anything in there. But still gave the thumbs up. Better look. My friend had a much better looking one. By the way, she's not my girlfriend. She's just a friend that's a foodie. And we have a mutual respect on that level. So here's my final bowl. I think this was bowl number five. I think I missed one on camera. I threw a little bit of fish in there. There's some more of that squid. A little bit of those mushrooms, those skinny ones. Forget the name. Some bok choy. And we finished it off with some vanilla ice cream, some durian, chocolate, and coconut. So there's some pretty dang cool bathrooms in different places, right? Freaking crazy. Look at this. Look at this big ass tree that they have in the freaking bathroom. Look at this thing. Check this out. This is like some Bali, like beach resort type bathroom. This is in the center of the city, right next to the urinals. It's crazy. I will say, the $12 all you can eat hot pot buffet was awesome. This place was good. The quality of it was good too. This place was amazing. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.